guys are ready to begin. Can we have you? Thank you. Welcome. Come as close as you can, please. Because don't worry about the camera. The camera will not be on you. It'll be on me. But it will be easier to teach as a smaller, congested group as opposed to spread out. Okay. I don't have a pen. I don't think you need a pen right now. Okay. Purposely. We're not going to read or write. <laughs> That's why. That's for school. <laughs> That's for school. We're live. Peta. Now, ladies and gentlemen, welcome. I'm going to address the camera because we are live, and we're going to welcome the, the guests we have as well, too. So welcome again to Mamuyatitan. It's a Cree language course offered by the City of Regina and the Regina Public Library. This class is live stream, so my interaction will be with you as, as students that are physically present here. We encourage members at home to encourage the other family members to participate. We encourage intergenerational family learning within the home. So if you're able to, in your home, in your settings, wherever you may come from, please encourage your children to learn along with the parents and the grandparents if possible. As I said, the course will run for a period of 12 weeks, every Thursday from 6.30 to 8.30. We'd like to acknowledge again uh, Cree Thunder Entertainment for providing live streaming. Thank you, Corey General. Corey General is from, uh, from the Dakota Nation, and he is also an avid supporter of First Nations languages, providing technological services for Nakota, Dakota, Lakota, Soto, and Cree, the First Nations languages within Saskatchewan. I, uh, we also would like to acknowledge Wendy Sinclair, who is the librarian here at the Regina Public Library, for offering us this space, providing this opportunity for you, and providing this opportunity for you at home. We'd also like to acknowledge Nick Crichton from the City of Regina, who have also made this possible in partnering with the Regina Public Library, and is an avid supporter of First Nations languages. And I'd like to acknowledge you all here tonight. I'd like to acknowledge the people at home as well, too, as you have an acquired need. Your need is to learn a language, to learn your language, to learn a First Nations language. But it also gives you insight into a perspectivity of culture, into why we say things and how things are said. So at this time, ladies and gentlemen, Again, I'd like to personally thank you at least for giving time, commitment, opportunity for me to share my language and for you to acquire your First Nations language. Tawao, get to them Scott. Now, welcome. I greet you all. I will tell who I am. My name is Darren Okamasum. I am a Cree. And my Cree is what the way we call Nipsigupawinoak. It's not the Northern Cree, it's not this Plains Cree, but it runs along the forest line. We are what they call the Willow Cree. It is also a Plains Cree sub-dialect, but not a direct dialect. In so far, we just have some little regional variances. There is no major change from the Plains Cree language. Okay? What does the Cree language sound? What you're hearing now, people understand each other. They communicate. So that is the purpose of this course. It's not an academic course. We're not here to read or write. We're here as family members, community members, to learn communicative language. What can we use in the home? How can we teach others? How can we share what we know? And how can we promote and enhance language learning? Okay. So that's your responsibility. And that is your passion. And that's why you're here tonight and at home. Thank you. Okay. I, uh, I'm from the Beardies and Okamasis First Nation. Okay. Which is Kamistua Sirego Okamasis Iskunganik and Peochi. Exactly what I said. I'm from the Beardies and Okamasis First Nation. Uh, it's located half hour, 45 minutes north of Saskatoon, on route to Prince Albert, three miles west of Duck Lake. 
Okay? I, uh, as a community member, as a, a member within my family, I really appreciated being talked to in Cree. As a child, I heard it, I seen it, I spoke it. People just naturally gave language to each other. But it was the shape of the family that determined success, my success, because and I give credit to my late mother, to my father, and also to my grandparents for speaking eloquently to me, for providing me that language learning opportunity. I graduated from high school with Cree 30. An accredited program finally through the province of Saskatchewan. We were the first ones in Saskatchewan, Duck Lake, the provincial school, to offer this accredited program. I finished it, I graduated with it. I used that credit to get into university years back. So there is a rightful place in our academic system for language, especially the Cree language. It further promoted language learning for me. And to I kept on going to school and I finished my education. I finished three degrees with the University of Regina, all focusing and specializing in our First Nations languages. But it was a passion of mine. I first started off as an admin major, but I didn't see myself finding benefit in life by sitting behind a desk and putting numbers especially dollars that are not mine, right? <laughs> yes. So I, I made a complete switch, turn around from admin to linguistics, Cree linguistics, and I never went wrong. It's been an incredible journey. It's been an incredible opportunity. I started young, right out of high school, came to university fresh out of high school, and took Cree as a major. And that was 25 plus years ago. Yes. But it's been a quite a language learning opportunity, both as an instructor and as a learner. There is never a day that I do not learn. There's always something. Something I heard from long ago. It reminds me. Right? Where did I hear that? Who said that to me? When you start on this language journey, you're going to be walking and going, thinking, where did I hear that? How did I hear that? Going back and getting that language child and bringing it forward. Okay? But in essence, that's my, that's my background, that's my passion. But there is a further passion which will not inhibit me and I don't want you to pity me. I am living with cancer. I've been living with cancer for six years. I'm on chemotherapy every two weeks. But it doesn't inhibit me because language learning and language teaching gives me that hope. It gives me my rightful place in this world. My journey. And it doesn't inhibit me from continuing to learn. I know I'm not going to beat the disease, but it's not going to beat me. I'm going to fight. So that's who I am, and that's the background of, of me. So I'm willing to provide and share with you insights, opportunities for you to use the language in the home, for you to promote the language within your family, in your family. Okay? So welcome. We still keep getting numbers coming in, which is good. So does anybody here speak Cree? We have four language speakers here. Look at that, ladies and gentlemen. Compare that to your, to your community. How many language learners and speakers do we have within our communities? Those are the sources of our, our knowledge. We must respect their rightful place. So therefore, I welcome you as language speakers. I greet you well. Okay. Everybody, let's start speaking. Say, Tanse. 
Okay, say no more nanto. Go like this, to. Not the eye, nanto. Yananto. Moyananto. No more nanto. Danse in Cree is a greeting, but it does not just mean hello. It asks about your state. How are you? So danse is just not just a simple greeting. And the response, namoya nanto, nothing is really the matter. Hello, how are you? I'm fine, technically, right? If you modernize the English, but if you look at it literally, danse is hello, how are you? It's not just hi. It asks about your being. It gives you that respect initially upon contact. And your response, nothing is really the matter. Namoya nanto. So everybody say that, danse. Namoinanto. Again, Namoinanto. Let's sound Cree. Namoinanto. <laughs> Good. <laughs> but again, as I said, this class is not structured in an academic sense. This class is for communicative purposes. Okay, so if there's any time you're tired, we need a break, and you determine the course. We will meet weekly, and our time is from 6.30 to 8.00. But let's make use of that time, okay? So again, as I said, tanse is a greeting, and hello, how are you? But it, it also asks a question. It becomes a pronoun. It switches to roles. The next one, tanse, kitsika, shun. People in English will say, what is your name? Literally, it means, how are you called? Remember, it's not English, so we don't look at it from the framework of English grammar, English context. We look at it from its literal perspective, what's it saying? Right? So, how are you called? But technically, what is your name? And your response? Blah, blah, blah. Okay? Say that. Son. Gasun. Look at this. Si gasun. Te si gasun. Kitsi gasun. Is you, that K is you, tan si kitsi gasun. Okay? And your response? Nitsi gasun. Can you say that? Nitsi gasun. Go like this. I, this is my famous. Nitsi. Nits. See, Gasun. <laughs> you got nits. Okay. Again, nits, see, Gasun. Okay. That's me, nits, nits. I'm all nitty. Gasus come out now. I'll spread it all to you. Okay. Nits, see, Gasun is I am called. So everybody say that. Nits, see, Gasun. One more. Sun. I have a lot of language learners that will incorporate the sound so, but it's not so, it's sun. Ga sun. Si ga sun. Ti si ga sun. Nit si ga sun. Listen, simple question. Darren nit si ga sun. Dance kit si ga sun. Nick. <laughs> so you got it there. Everybody, One more time. Hi, hi, excellent. Good. Instead of going randomly, let's go step by step. Okay? Again, one more time. Nitsika sun. Slowly. Nitsika sun. What's up? You're first. Darren Nitsika. I'll ask the question. Look. Darren Nitsika sun. Tansikitsika sun. What do you think I'm saying? My name is Darren. What is your name, right? Okay. Darren Nitsi Kasun Tansikitsi Kasun. Good. Darren Nitsi Kasun Tansikitsi Kasun. 
Hai hai dere nit si kasun tan si kit si kasun kia. Adre nit si kasun. Good. Why don't you just give the mic and pass it on? Okay. Dere nit si kasun tan si kit si kasun. Ah, taron nit si kasun. Good. Thank you. Dere nit si kasun tan si kit si kasun. Ryan nit si kasun. Good. Dere nit si kasun tan si kit si kasun. Raquel Nitsi Kasson. Excellent. Dere Nitsi Kasson, Tansi Kitsi Kasson. Desiree Nitsi Kasson. Excellent. Dere Nitsi Kasson, Tansi Kitsi Kasson. Vivian Nitsi Kasson. Good, excellent. Dere Nitsi Kasson, Tansi Kitsi Kasson. Nick Nikiasson. That's my phone. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. My, my phone's ringing over there, but I'll leave it alone. Okay, go. Dere Nitsi Kasson. Tansi Kitsi Kasson. Henry Nitsi Kasson. Good. Dere Nitsi Kasson, Tansi Kitsi Kasson. Who want to say it? You can, you can, it's okay. Everybody's going to do it and you're in a safe place, remember that. Okay, let's pass. Tansi Dere Nitsi Kasson, Tansi Kitsi Kasson. Victoria Nitsi Kasson. Good. Now, wait a minute. Dere Nitsi Kasson, Tansi Kitsi Kasson. Kevin Nick. Nitsi Kasson. There you go. Once you see that, Dere Nitsi Kasson, Tansi Kitsi Kasson. Jonathan Nitsi Kasson. Good, excellent. Tansi, Dere Nitsi Kasson, Tansi Kitsi. Corinne Nitsi Kasson. Oh, let me finish my. Let me finish my. Okay, Tansi, Dere Nitsi Kasson, Tansi Kitsi Kasson. Hannah Nitsi Kasson. Hi, hi, welcome. Tanse, Dere Nitsi Kasson, Tanse Kitsi Kasson. Keegan Nitsi Kasson. Excellent, hi, hi. Tanse, Dere Nitsi Kasson, Tanse Kitsi Kasson. Sean Kiesat. Nitsi Kasson. Excellent. Tanse, Dere Nitsi Kasson, Tanse Kitsi Kasson. Andrew Nitsi Kasson. Hi, hi. I go Tanse, Dere Nitsi Kasson, Tanse Kitsi Kasson. Charlene Nitsi Kasson. Good. Tanse Dere Nitsi Kasson, Tanse Kitsi Kasson. Zaria Nitsi Kasson. Hi, hi. I go here. Good. Tanse, good afternoon. Dere Nitsi Kasson, Tanse Kitsi Kasson. Deborah Nitsi Kasson. Good, excellent. Tanse Dere Nitsi Kasson, Tanse Kitsi Kasson. Jen Nitsi Kasson. That's another one of my students. Tanse Dere Nitsi Kasson, Tanse Kitsi Kasson. Elizabeth Nitsi Kasson. Excellent. Hi, hi. Tansi Dere Nitsi Kasson, Tansi Kitsi Kasson. Phyllis Nitsi Kasson. Excellent. Tansi Dere Nitsi Kasson, Tansi Kitsi Kasson. Colin Nitsi Kasson. Kasson. Excellent. Thank you. Now, let's run all the way to the end over there, Alex. <laughs> Welcome. Here, quick lesson. Just come in. Say this. Nits. Si kasun. Nitsi kasun. Look, Darren Nitsi kasun. Tansi kitsi kasun. Tansi Aaron Nitsi kasun. Excellent. Good. Picked it up right away. Nitsi. Tansi Darren Nitsi kasun. Tansi kitsi kasun. Sydney Nitsi kasun. Hi, hi. Welcome, Sydney. Can you pass that over, please? Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. But get used to your voices, right? Get used to your voices. If you make a mistake, so be it. We're not here to correct or provide perfect speech upon the first day. Tense, Dere Nitsi Kasson, Tense Kitsi Kasson. James Nitsi Kasson. Good, excellent. Ego kia? Tense Kitsi Kasson kia? Dere Nitsi Kasson. Can I just mention, Darian Ajikute is one of our Cree language majors at the First Nations University. He's also our tutor, and he's an avid language learner. Welcome, Darian. Tanse, Darren Nitsi Kasson, Tanse Kitsi Kasson. Moinado. Moinado, good. Darren Nitsi Kasson. Kasson. Tanse Kitsi Kasson? What's your name? Kasson. Nitsi Kasson. Nitsi Kasson. Okay. Tanse, Darren Nitsi Kasson, Tanse Kitsi Kasson. Rainier Nitsi Kasson. Good, can you just hold that for a bit? Yeah. Pohui te keitu teid mana se mag. Oh, we like ya. Keitu goon. Wherever you go somewhere, you're going to be asked, who are you? Maga. Nigan ka kwechi ke mog. Oh, we like ne gigwak. Oh, we like mosum. Oh, we like kogum. 
Who are your parents? Who are your grandparents? They'll initially ask you. If they don't know who you are, they'll know your parents or your grandparents. And that's how they recognize relations, if you must. And there's a word, say this, tapakutawin. Tapakutawin in Cree is a value we have. It's a relationship term. It's a kinship term. Tapakutawin, tapakumagan is my adopted family member. Our people, if we're not related, we adopt so we become related. And in doing so, we give them that same value, that same respect as uncle, brother, sister, auntie, that immediate. Okay, that's tapakutuin. And which is interesting because it gets me to a point that language is rich. There's so much of our culture interpreted through the language, so much expressed, whether it's ceremony, whether it's meeting each other personally, or it's conveying important and critical information. Right? It's so concise. You say one word wrong, it means a totally, totally different word altogether. One letter wrong. So it's so concise. And a lot of my students know that because whilst I'm teaching, I recognize errors they make, but at the same time, I also tell them what, they, what they're saying to me is risque. <laughs> and while we are watching, they're swearing at me. <laughs> but they don't know what they're doing. That's, but it's fun. It's, it's fun learning. But as I said, be, uh, pay attention to sound. Pay attention to the, how it's produced. Because one sound is a totally different word. Example, sagaygan, a nail. Sagaygan is a lake. Totally different things. Okay? So that's why, for Cree speakers, for they're concise, they're precise. Bage mutsigak, nesto kane hiowek epapik. It's fun. Every time people are talking Cree, you hear laughter. You hear laughter at funerals. You hear laughter at band offices, at band meetings. Everywhere you go, there's laughter. And I think that's the value that we maintained. We may have lost elements of our language, but there's opportunities like this for language learning. At the same time, we're still respecting that value of treating someone with respect. We're just missing the language part. And that's what communication, this communicative course, is about. Okay? <laughs> And that's another value I want to talk about. Where I come from, Beardies and Okamasis, they treat visitors with respect. They like visitors. They welcome, welcome. They, they, their place of origin is also of interest to them. Where are you from? Then they'll know, do I know somebody from there? Do I have a relative from there? Do I have friends there? I've been to your community. It entices and encourages communication. Greetings, when they greet each other. Next though, they want to know, or say hello. Who are you? Where are you from? Right? So let's say the next one. Everybody, let's go this way. Chin. That C by itself is a CH sound. Chin. Now H is like a breath of air coming out. To chin. Good. Nito chin. Remember that ne is always me. Ki is you. Nitsigasun. Kitsigasun. Say that. Nitsigasun. Kitsigasun. Nito chin. Kito chin. Good. Good. You see that? That ne is me and that ke is you. Nimitsun. Kimitsun. Right? Ne, I'm doing the action. Ke, you are. It's the same thing with the greetings. Kits, so what is your name? We did this already. Your response was blah blah blah. Nitsika sun. The next one, Tante Kito Chin. So again, let's do the whole thing. Chin. To chin. That aspirated age, like a breath of air coming out. But it don't spit on your neighbor, okay? To chin. Kito chin. Te kito chin. Tan te. 
Kitochin. Tante, where are you from? Tante Kitochin. Where is your place of origin, technically? Okay? So I'll ask you the question. Tante Kitochin, your response will be wherever you're from. Nitochin. Okay? Hypothetically, I could say Tanse. Look at this, just these three. Tanse. Darren Nitsikashan. Beardies no kamasis netochin. See how I just intro I was able to say hello, introduce my name and where I'm from. Initial questions people will ask when they meet you. Okay, so let's try that everybody. Tanse Nitsikashan Nitochin. Excellent. I'll ask you a question. Tante Kitochin. Yours would be White Bear. Nito chin. Everybody, one more time. Nito chin. Tante kito chin. Excellent. Tante kito chin. Good. Ego tante kito chin. Tante kito chin. Ego tante kito chin. Tante kito chin. Laurence, tante kito chin. Hello, welcome back. Both, eh? <laughs> tante kito chin. Six Nations, Ontario, excellent. Tante Kitochin? Tante Kitochin? I go Tante Kitochin. Bring it here, bring it here. Nick, bring it here. Start here, bring it here. I'll, I'll take that for now, okay? I'm going, we're going to do the same thing, and don't be intimidated, okay? It's just the voice, the camera's not on you. They don't, they, all they see is the back of your head. And your Nitsiga. <laughs> Okay, so this will be going around, and this is just in at least hearing your voice. Okay, be comfortable with your voice. I'm going to pass it around. Okay, just uh, just show them just to, to what I'm going to happen. Okay, thank you. Uh, yeah. So again, I'll ask the question. Tante kito chin. Excellent. Good. Oh, but pass it around. Tante tante kito chin. <laughs> Our elder. Tante Kitochin. Uskanaka Tastege. Kasastege. Kasastege. Come on, beard is a mochiga. She's from my reserve. <laughs> from my reserve. Tanse, Tante Kitochin. Regina Nitochin. Good. Tanse, Tante Kitochin. Regina Nitochin. Hi, hi. Tanse, Tante Kitochin. Regina Nitochin. Good, excellent. Tanse, Tante Kitochin. Regina Nitochin. You were just from White Bear for five seconds ago. <laughs> You're from White Bear too. <laughs> just saying. I'm not last. Vivian Nitochin. <laughs> oh my God, what is White Bear. Oh, Tanse, Tante Kitochin. White bear. White bear. Yes, <laughs> 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 doesn't stop with you. Tanse, tante kitochin. Regina nitochin. Good, excellent. I go here, tanse, tante kitochin. Regina nitochin. Excellent. Tanse. No, 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 Regina Nitochin. Excellent. Tanse Tante Kitochin. Regina Nitochin. Good, excellent. Tanse Tante Kitochin. Laurence Nitochin. Good. Ego Kenawe. Tanse Tante Kitochin. Kakuistau Nitochin. Excellent. Kakuistau. Good. Ego Tanse Tante Kitochin. Pasqua Nitochin. Pasqua. Good. Excellent. We got Koak, Pasqua, White Bear, and one from Regina. Tanse Tante Kitochin. Uh, Gordon's Nitochi. Gordon is looking good. Actually, we got good representation from his First Nation communities. Tanse, Tante Kitochin. Sturgeon Lake Nitochi. Sturgeon Lake, excellent. Tanse, Tante Kitochin. Regina. Let's play the mic. Oops, I just spit out of you. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> But that's free. Tanse, Tante Kitochin. Regina Nitochin. Hi, hi, thank you. I go Tanse, Tante Kitochin. Quakatus Nitochin. Excellent. Tanse, Tante Kitochin. Quakatus Nitochin. Excellent. I go Tanse, Tante Kitochin. 
Good, excellent, good. Can you hand that over to the gentleman in the back there, please? Regina Nitochin. Good. Good, excellent. Oswego Do you speak Mohawk? Yes, a little bit, yeah. Excellent. Welcome. Thank you. Uh, Regina Nitochin. Excellent. I go dance, dance, get touching. How is this with Nitochin? Good. I go dance, dance, get touching. From Salt Lake. Montreal Lake. Salt Lake. Salt Lake. Yeah. Nitochin. Nitochin. Excellent. Welcome. I go dance, dance, get touching. Uh, Philippines, Nitochin. Philippines. We have Philippines, Salt Lake, Cowessis, Gordons, Pasqua, Kakuistahau. White Bear, Regina, <laughs> Piapot, Cowessis. Oh, we got great representation here today. LaRange, where are you from again? Coacatus as well, okay. Good, welcome, welcome. I, uh, as I said earlier, I appreciate and respect your presence here. Thank you, honestly. It's a safe place. It's a safe place to learn. So at this point, I'm going to randomly pick people. Yes, I'll, I have an assistant over here that's going to run about <laughs> yes, from the city of Regina. <laughs> so, you're first. Dance. Uh, One more time, everybody. Namoyananto. Namoyananto. Interestingly enough, I have students that have little mnemonic devices, little memory hooks. Namoyananto, they'll say, my nine toes, <laughs> just, to, just so they'll remember. Or else they'll go, Moya Nintendo. <laughs> but it's Namoinanto. One more time. Tanse? Namoinanto. Dere Nitsi Kasson. Tanse Kitsi Kasson. Raquel Nitsi Kasson. Beardies Ochinia. Tante Ochigia. Regina Nitochin. Excellent. Look at that, eh? Look at that. Same responses. Go give that gentleman in the back. <laughs> I might as well center you out there, Ed. Ed is a mathematician and a professor at the First Nations University as well, too, from the Six Nations. <laughs> so, Tanse. Tanse. <laughs> You're not a quick learner, are you? <laughs> right. If it's math, You're, I'm okay. But. You're good? You just come and touch me. <laughs> Again, Tanse. Edward Nitsi Kasson. Beardies Nitochin Tante Kitochin. Oswego Nitochin. Excellent. Give it to Stelman, please. All those three. But you know them anyway, right? Tanse. Namoya Nanto. Tanse Kitsi Kasson. Jonathan Nitsi Kasson. Tante Ochikia. Tante Kitochin. Pasqua. Nitochin. Excellent. Look at that. Hey, you're able to say hello, respond to a greeting. You're able to identify who you are and where you come from. Yeah, that's right on. Within a couple of minutes. Hey, Andrew, right on. Good. <laughs> he likes that. Give that to this gentleman. <laughs> come on, speed up. My sister's a little slow. <laughs> Tanse. Namaya Nanto. Darren Nitsi Kasun. Tanse Kitsi Kasun. Henry Nitei Carlson. Good. Beardies Nitochin, Tante Kitochin. Regina Nitochin. Excellent. Good, good. Just take a break there for a bit, okay? <laughs> Tante. Namoya Nantau. Darren Nitsei Carlson, Tante Kitsei Carlson. Ryan Nitsei Carlson. Beardies Nitochin, Tante Kitochin. Regina Nitochin. Good. Give it to that gentleman behind you, please. 
<laughs> it's not like I'm trying to put you on the spot, but give everybody an opportunity. It's a free place. If you make a mistake, so be it. Okay? There is no right way, there's no wrong way, there's just different ways, okay? Tanse. Tanse. Namoye. Namoye nananto. Good. Be a darin at si kasun, tanse kit si kasun. Sean is na kasun. Be a dis na tochin, tante kit tochin. Regina na tochi. Good. Give it to that gentleman way behind you. <laughs> Pass the mic. <laughs> Should we pass the hat? Eh? <laughs> Good evening, Tanse. Namoe Nanto. Darren Nitsi Kasson, Tansi Kitsi Kasson. James Nitsi Gashon. Good. Beardies Nitochin, Tante Kitochin. Regina Nitochin. Good. Can you pass that to this lady in the corner here, please? <laughs> She's smiling. Who? <laughs> Good evening. Tansa. Nanoya Nanato. Nanoya Nanto. Nanto. Good. Excellent. Dara Nitsi Kasun, Tansi Kitsi Kasun. Deborah Nitsi Kasun. Kasun. Good. Beardies Nito Chin, Tante Kito Chin. Regina Nito. Nitochi. Good. Nitochi. And just for camera purposes, for those at home, I'm referring, I'm shortening my community to Beardies instead of Beardies and Okamasis, but giving respect to both, especially to those watching from home, because my family's online too right now. <laughs> right behind you. Tansa. Namoya Nanto. Dere Nitsi Kasun, Tansi Kitsi Kasun. Rainier Nitsi Kasun. Beardies Nitochin, Tante Kitochin. Uh, Philippines Nitochen. Excellent, welcome. And Mick, bring that to this guy here, please. Just that I didn't want to walk and have him get up, sit here, sitting around, do nothing. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> My good friend, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> City of Regina, pardon me. Tansa. Nemoya Nato. Darren Nitsi Kasun, Tansi Kitsi Kasun. Tyrone Nitsi Kasun. Good. Beardies Nitochin, Tante Kitochin. Uh, Regina Nitushin. Good, excellent. Pass Good. that to this lady from Regina. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> We're going to remember you. <laughs> Dance. Namoya Nanto. Dere Nitsi Kasun, Tansi Kitsi Kasun. Desiree Nitsi Kasun. Beardies Nitochin, Tante Kitochin. White bear. <laughs> Sorry about this, but repetition is the key, right? I'm trying to give everybody the language learning opportunity, okay? But we're going to go into something new right after this, okay? Something you cannot prepare for. Panse. Oh, get out of the way. <laughs> she wants to read it. She's a literate woman. Panse. Darren Nitsi Kasun, Tansi Kitsi Kasun. Corinne Nitsi Kasun. Good. Beardies Nitochin, Tansi Kitochin. Gordon's Nitochin. Good. Give that to this lady, please. <laughs> Try the one behind. <laughs> there, right there. <laughs> yes, Victoria. <laughs> Dance. Dance. No, 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 take him out. Good. Darren, it's Dance, it's Victoria, it's sick. Good. Beardy's Nitochin, Tante Kitochin. A couple more. One more. This lady in the corner, please. Oh, they're groaning. Look at this. Dance. Namoya Nanato. Yeah? Dance get sick, Kasson. Danielle Nitisi Kasson. Beardies Nitochin, Tante Kitochin. Laurence Nitochin. Okay, good. One more. Give that gentleman in the back there. Might as well do both of those gentlemen back there. <laughs> back to back. Tansa. Namoya Nanitao. Good. Tansa Kitsi Kasun. Aaron Nitisi Gasan. Beardies Nitochin, Tante Kitochin. Askana Nitochin. Good. Ladies and gentlemen, when you're speaking as much as possible, although it's written there, try to say it without looking and reading. Make it natural conversation, okay? You don't want to go, Nitisi Kasun. <laughs> Okay. Somebody wants to look at you if you're going to talk to them, right? I apologize that we were late, but could you repeat Okay. We'll get to this, okay? We'll repeat it. Watch, listen. Dance. 
Moi nanto. Dare nitsi kason, tansi kitsi kason. Sydney nitsi kason. Good. Beardies nito chin, tante kito chin. Causes nito chin. Good, excellent. Can you take that? Just for, there's a, there's a lady requested, she wants this broken down. Let's, let's do it just for repetition, all okay? right? So everybody, kitsi kason. Sun. Kason. Si kason. Tisi kason. Kitsi kason. Nitsi kason. Darren. Nitsi kason. Don't say Darren. Okay. Good. Okay. Just to deal with an icebreaker, okay? I'm going to use TPR, which is verbs and actions that you do on a daily basis. Things that you can do as you wake up and repeat and remind yourself and say them to yourself and say them to others. One of the most interesting things about this language teaching method is called total physical response. You learn by what you hear, see, and do. Repetition is the key. But it also parallels our language learning as children. Where we're told to do something, we're taught something, we're told rep repetitively. If not, we got a hit. <laughs> Whilst at the same time, though, it's, it mimics a child's way of learning. They learn by what they hear, see, and do. It's a natural form of learning. Now, I'm not going to write any verbs down, but you're all going to have to stand up. I, uh, Corey, if they stand up, will that interfere with your streaming? Okay, good. Kristen, you're okay with your toy camera? I mean, <laughs> <laughs> Kristen Adjigute from CTV News and formerly Indigenous Circle. Welcome and thank you for promoting our our language and our and our learners. Thank you. I, uh, as I said, I, I commend you as well. This is not a success without you. Okay. So these are actions in a day. Stand up. Everyone stand up. And you got to do and say what I do. Okay? Repetition is the key. So make sure you can see me if you can. If you're not, you can come closer around. Make sure you see. Okay. Come on in. Come on in. There's a lot of room in front here, guys. <laughs> okay. Everybody. Nepa. Do the action. <laughs> One of my students is so stubborn. <laughs> Again, nipa. Okay, I'm taking the cover and taking it off of me. One ska. Nipa. One ska. Miakasoso. I'm smudging. Okay, I'm smudging. Okay, nipa. One ska. Miakasoso. Kasi kwe. Nepa, one ska, miaka soso, kasi kwe, sigoho, again, nepa, one ska, miaka soso, kasi kwe, sigoho, pimnoa so, it's my flapjack, I'm cooking, but you gotta make that sound. Okay, again, nepa, one ska, Miaka soso, kasi kwe, sigoho, pimnoa so. Ape. No, everybody, no, no, stand up. This is what you do, you're not supposed to do it. Stand up, everybody. Again, nipa, one ska, miaka soso, kasi kwe, sigoho. Them know us so. A pe. Meet so. Nepa. One ska. Miaka so. Kasi kwe. Sigoho. Them know us so. A pe. Meet so. Minigwe. 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 Nepa. One ska. Miaka so. Kasi kwe, sigoho, pimnoa so, ape, mitso, 
<laughs> you see how quick that language teaching method is? It's a natural way of learning. Repetition is the key. But we were told that as kids, get up. 
When Skagagwa, come on, get up now. Right? Time and again, morning after morning, get up now. You open meat, Sugagwa, come and eat now. Right? Repetition is the key. And that's an example of how we naturally learned a language through that method. So throughout the weeks, we're going to be promoting that method and using that method continuously so that we can derive from you natural speaking context where you can communicate with somebody naturally in a home when you go visit somebody. When you meet somebody new, you can introduce yourself. Things that are purposeful and meaningful for you when you want to communicate to somebody. That is the goal of this course. The goal is not the reading and writing. It enhances learning. But that's not the focus of this course. How many of you are enjoying the course so far? Good. You guys are coming back next week? Good. We have about 30 minutes remaining. Wendy, if I may get your attention here, and Corey, and for people back home, I need a five minute break. Is that okay? Can you, language learners from home, please stay with us. We'll be back in five minutes. Stay tuned. Technical difficulties. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, take a, take a stretch, take a break. I need to use a washroom. <laughs>
Starting here shortly, uh, we took a five minute break and for those people participating here, they are provided with some snacks and refreshments to help them with their language learning. But for those back home, ladies and gentlemen, I encourage you to practice. I encourage you to uh, provide language learning opportunities for your children, for your family, for your grandchildren. Um, let's do this collectively, if I may say. I don't want to do it by myself. I can facilitate the language learning, but their purpose and the onus is on you all to use and practice the language as you're able to, as you know it. Use it in natural context, which is the aim and purpose and the goal of this course. Okay? So far, we seem to be enjoying it I, from the looks on your faces, and, and at least you're not bored and falling asleep. Thank you, Ed. <laughs> Pardon me. We'll be starting here shortly. So for people back home, I'm going to break down that TPR step by step slowly again so that one, people at home can look at it in isolation and learn and practice. Secondly, for the benefit of language learners here, you get to hear it slowly broken down. But how quick you picked up that language without reading and writing it Picking up an ear for it, eh? That's what you need to do initially from the onset, is what, is, what sounds does Cree make? How do I put those sounds together to formulate words? How do I use those words to express my meaning and convey what I want to say? Right? It, starts, it starts from simple to a, to a larger possibility of communication across the generations you may want to speak to. Kokumen Mushum can stutagok. Kokumen Mushum will understand you. Kyama toy moine hio et sig, they've still been around, even though they don't speak Cree, they've been around Cree people. They know these processes of introductions, they know the protocols, they know communication. Right? We've been mixing intertribally for years amongst all these tribes through different languages. We used our own language to communicate with strangers, but we found a means of communication. And it's the same set here, the same context. We're finding a means to communicate and to find something we need to use on a daily basis. Hence that TPR complemented that. Activities throughout the day. When you go home and practice, think about those activities when you wake up in the morning. Say that word. I mean, say that to yourself when you're doing it. <laughs> but thank you. You're, you're, you're a responsive audience. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> but I, yes, you're, 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 you're a great learner. <laughs> but uh, my, my point there was, as you're doing it at home, say it to yourself. Practice it, right? When you're combing your hair. Right? When you're cooking. Okay, all activities in a day you can reflect on and how you can use the language in your daily context. That was the purpose of that exercise. Okay? It was effective, wasn't it? You feel good about it? Good, because next week we're going to do this again, but you guys are going to lead. <laughs> we'll practice, okay? Okay, we're going to start here formally once I put my uh, cup down. So I may need you to swallow what you're chewing so, so that it doesn't interfere with you talking, okay? Let me finish my water, huh? <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Again, just for, just for Kunta, just for the heck of it, okay? Just for Kunta. Kia, tansa. Good. Darren, it's sih kasun, tansa, it's sih kasun. Beardies na tochin, tante ki tochin. Good. Give it to that young guy right here. <laughs> Tansa. Mari. Namoya Nanto. Mari. Good. Excellent. Darren Nitsikasun. Tansi Kitsikasun. Colin Nitsi Council. Beardies Nitochin. Tante Kitochin. Regina. Regina. Good, excellent. Pass it to this gentleman next to you, please. Dancer. Moyananto. Good. 
Der net sich gassen, dann sich jetzt sich gassen. Steven net sich gassen. Get beardies net ochin, dann take it ochin. As kann ich as a steke ochin ja. Good. Get this young gentleman there. Eh? I really like the cross section of ages in this in this room. Look at the young gentlemen. Look at the young, the young teenagers. Look at the adults, the young adults, the older adults. Look at the kokums and the mushrooms we have here as well too. You know, great. Thank you again, ladies and gentlemen. There you are. Pardon me. Where's that guy? Dancer. Moyenanto. Darren Nitsikasun, Tansikitsikasun. Kigin Nitsikasun. Beardies Nitochin, Tantikitochin. Sturgeon Lake Nitochin. Good. Let's take that and give it to this gentleman. Come on, Nick. Thank you. You're not Nick. Dancer. Dancer. Next week when we come, you may find the tables and chairs in a different arrangement. I think I'm going to have it open and sitting around like this. Then we get you off the chairs and standing, interacting in a circle. Okay? You, you don't worry about the camera. The camera's on me, not you. Remember that, okay? At the same time, at least we can interact and move around. Plus, I want you guys to greet each other as well, too. Introduce who you are, where you come from, get to know each other as classmates as well, too. As community members within the city of Regina. After all that, dance. Namoya, na. That's your cue. Dere nit sikasun, dance kit sikasun. Nick nit sikasun. Beardies nit ochin, dante kit ochin. Regina nit. You're not from White Bear too? <laughs> That's you? Dance. Namoya Nanto. Dere Nitsi Kasson, Tansi Kitsi Kasson. Raquel Nitsi Kasson. Beardies Nitochin, Tante Kitochin. Regina Nitochin. Next gentleman, please might as well pass around a bit there. Dance. Namoya Nanto. Dare net sikasun tante kit sikasun. Ryan net sikasun. Beardies net ochin tante kit ochin. Ryan net ochin. You're from Regina. Ryan. You're from Ryan. <laughs> <laughs> that young lady behind you. Hey, eh? come on, you can speak better Korean. Eh? <laughs> I like these young, uh, well, young adults here. Let me explain something for you first, okay? Wuskayak, say that. A wasak. A wasak are children. Uskayak are the youth. But let me explain that word etymologically. Where does that word come from? Uskayak are the new people. In Cree, there is no specific term for a teenager. You move from a child to a young adult. But with that comes the responsibilities of a young adult. You go through changes, fasting, getting your name, ceremonializing that journey. So literally, uskini gu which is what a young male is called, an adolescent male, but it's literally a new man. He becomes a new man, Uskinigu. Uskinik Squel is a young adolescent woman, but is literally a new woman. So Uskayag are the new people, the new adults. There is no term specifically for teenager in Cree. That concept does not exist. But rather we address them and identify them as new. The new man, the new woman. Okay? Uskape or sak, yes. But those are the if you interestingly enough, Uskape Usk is a server at the ceremonies. But that usk is there, which is uske, which is new. Uskapeo wisnapeo new man per se. But that's a different role. That term is applied in a context of ceremony. There's a specific role he or she has. And that name is acquired at any age and any generation. It could be a young man as a server. It could be an old man as a server. So it really does not, it's not age specific, but it's context specific in a context of ceremony. Where is that rightful place as a server? Right? It could be any age. Okay? But it's interesting. Good question. Yes. Now, where was there you are? Where was I? Dancer. 
Again, time say. Time say, can you see? Gosh, right. Good. Beard is not touch in. Time take it touch in. Hand that to the lady behind you, please. <laughs> We're having you participate tonight, aren't we? <laughs> time say. Dare not see, gosh, right. Time say, can see, gosh, right. Debra Nitsi Kasu. Beard is not touching, time to take it touching. Rijana Nitsu Si. Nitsuchin. Nitsuchin. Good. Chin, like Jean, but Chin. Jean. Okay. Okay. There's a lady next to you there. Yeah, it's that bright little student of mine. <laughs> I'm mixing it up. Dare Nitsi Kasun, Tansi Kitsi Kasun. Jen Nitsi Kasun. Tansi. Hunamoyananto. Beardies not to chain, time to get to chain. Kaios, Oskana Kaios, a stay gain, Niteo chain. Kaos is that, no? Papixis. Papixis, pardon me. Okay, we can take that now, okay? <laughs> okay, good. So remember that, okay? For next week, when we come, we'll start off the class. We'll just informally say, Tan se, Dere Nitsi Kasun, Beardies not to chain. Okay? Let's just have the elder say that. <laughs> Put you on. Tanse dere net si kashon. Tanse kit si kashon. Sylvia net si kashon. Tanse. Monanto. Good. Tanse kit ochin. Neopatnach. Good. Our next woman, the, next, the emerging kokum. Kia, Audrey. <laughs> the emerging kokum. I'm just uh, I'm picking on my band member. She's from Beardies and Okamashes as well, too. And she also provides a language learning opportunity for you as well. She teaches Cree at the All Nations Hope and is also available to you as well, too, to partake. So there's sufficient and efficient language learning opportunities as well, too. So just just for purposes. Okay. I'm going to say it in a different mode, respond in that different mode. And we'll cover this next week, okay? Nigan Tanse. Nigan Tanse. Tanse. Monanto. Okay. Tanse Sigaswin. Audrin and Sigasun. Good, same thing, okay? Beardize Uchian, Tante Uchin. Nistominok Dochian. Okay, please. I'm from there too. She goes. Yes, okay. Just to show you, ladies and gentlemen, there are two modes of speech. Nitsihkasun, declarative sentences. I am, my name is. Esihkasoyan, I am called as well too. Okay, you have just two ways of saying it. But you can, when I asked Audrey here, Darren Esihkasoyan, and Esihkasoyan, my name is Darren, what is your name? And she said, Audrey Nitsihkasun, using this same form, but it's acceptable. There's just two ways of saying it. I don't want to confuse you, overwhelm you, but we'll look at those comparisons next week. Okay, just how, how come it's said that way, and why is it said this way? Okay, there is no real reason why. It's just two modes and two forms of speech. Okay, good. Now for benefit of all of you, and for those viewers at home, we're going to redo the TPR and we'll close off tonight with that. And, and, and we'll break it down slowly so the learners back home can practice and we'll, for you to internalize this activity. Bashigok! Bashigok! Okay. Now if we can somehow, if we can keep the center open as much as possible, the camera back home can see my entire action and learn themselves. Okay? Little guy, you're going to have to do this too, eh? Good? He's good. <laughs> so everybody. Nepa. Good. Everybody. Wanska. Nepa. Wanska. Miakasusa. Nepa. Wanska. Miakasusa. Kasi kwe. Ne poops. Ne pa. One ska. Miaka susa. Kasi kwe. Sigo ho. Sigo ho. Sorry. Ne pa. One ska. Miaka susa. Kasi kwe. Sigo ho. Pemeno wa so. Ne pa. Wanska. 
Nyaka soso. Kasi kwe. Sigoho. Pemeno weso. Ape. Nepa. Wanska. Nyaka soso. Kasi kwe. Sigoho. Pemeno weso. Ape. Mitso. Nepa. Wanska. Nyaka soso. Kasi kwe. Sigoho. Pemeno weso. Ape. Mitso. Mini kwe. Nepa. Wanska. Nyaka soso. Kasi kwe. Sigoho. Pemeno weso. Ape. Mitso. Mini kwe. Pasigo. Nepa. Wanska. Nyaka soso. Kasi kwe. Sigoho. Pemeno weso. Ape. Mitso. Mini kwe. Pasigo. Pemo te. Nepa. Wanska. Nyaka soso. Kasi kwe. Sigoho. Pemeno weso. Ape. Mitso. Mini kwe. Pasigo. Pemo te. Pempata. Nepa. Wanska. Nyaka soso. Kasi kwe. Sigoho. Pemeno weso. Ape. Mitso. Mini kwe. Pasigo. Pemote. Pempata. Sesawi. Nepa. Wanska. Nyaka soso. Kasi kwe. Sigoho. Pemeno weso. Ape. Mitso. Mini kwe. Pasigo. Pemote. Pempata. Sesawi. Nagamo. Nepa. Wanska. Nyaka soso. Kasi kwe. Sigoho. Pemeno weso. Ape. Mitso. Mini kwe. Pasigo. Pemote. Pempata. Sesawi. Nagamo. Nimito. Nepa. Wanska. Nyaka soso. Kasi kwe. Sigoho. Pemeno weso. Ape. Mitso. Mini kwe. Pasigo. Pemote. Pempata. Sesawi. Nagamo. Nimito. Ayamitsige. Nepa. Wanska. Nyaka soso. Kasi kwe. Sigoho. Pemeno weso. Ape. Mitso. Mini kwe. Pasigo. Pemote. Pempata. Sesawi. Nagamo. Ayamitsige. Ayamitsige. Masinaige. Nepa. Wanska. Nyaka soso. Kasi kwe. Sigoho. Pemeno weso. Ape. Mitso. Mini kwe. Pasigo. Pemote. Pempata. Sesawi. Nagamo. Nimito. Ayamitsige. Masinaige. Pemagutsene. Nepa. Wanska. Nyaka soso. Kasi kwe. Sigoho. Pemeno weso. Ape. Mitso. Mini kwe. Pasigo. Pemote. Pempata. Sesawi. Nagama. Nimito. Ayamitsige. Masinaige. Pemagutsene. 
Ki we. Nipa. Louder. Nipa. Anska. Nyak soso. Kasi kwe. Sigo ho. Pemno we sok. Ape. Mitso. Mini kwe. Pasigo. Pemno te. Pempata. Sesawi. Negomo. Nimito. <laughs> From the top, sorry, I was just about, that was my last uh, phrase. I was just about to finish there, right? Again, Nipa, one ska. Make sure they hear you, must repeating, standing buffalo. Nipa, one ska. Nyaka soso. Kasi kwe. Sigo ha. Pemno we sok. Ape. Mitso. Menikwe. Pasigo. Pemote. Pempata. Sesawi. Nagamo. Nimito. Oh, I am each other. Marcel Haige. Pema Gochene. Kiwe. Puegeto. I got sit out. Sit out. Sit out. Sit out. Sorry, I, I choked there, literally. <laughs> so that's how the class will be structured. We have a multi purpose room here that Mamoya Titan Library had, or Center had provided for us. Uh, we'll make this an activity based language learning. Secondly, one more thing for you to know just the perspectives of Cree. Kihtuam kawapamten. Say that. Kihtuam kawapamten. I will see you again. You don't have to say the English, but good. <laughs> but ladies and gentlemen, that's the only way to say goodbye in Cree. There is no word for goodbye in any North American Indian languages, both Canada and United States. We don't have that. That concept is too final, it's too definite. That we don't have that in our perspective. I will see you again. Even when somebody passes on and we're greeting and we're in the procession by the casket, I will see you again. There is. We'll all say it, but let's write it down, okay? Kihtuam kawa pamten. Tin. Metin. Pamten. Wa pamten. Kawa pamten. Tuam kawa pamten. That age. Kihtuam kawa pamten. Yes, just don't spit on your neighbor. Remember that. Kihtuam kawa pamten. Okay. Kihtuam kawa pamten. Now, wow. I will see you all again. I will see you again. I will see you all again. Okay? Ladies and gentlemen, that concludes our course. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen, for partaking in our language learning lessons here. We encourage you and support you to continue at home. Come down to the Mamoya Titan Center if you want face-to-face -face instruction and you're nearby. If not, we welcome you weekly to partake. And thank you to the learners here. Thank you to cross-generation of ages that are represented here today. And thank you from the Cree language learners and speakers because your effort is our effort. It's not my language, it's our language. I don't own this by myself, no one does. Therefore, my role in my facilitation is to give, share, and to teach. I thank you all. Can I them Scott now? I greet you all. Hi, hi, Exa. Cut. Keyword. So good? Good? Help yourself to more refreshments, please.